Hi everyone. A hundred video. Yeah. Awesome time. Awesome time. Right before I was about to film this, the window in my bedroom shattered. <laughs> crazy times. Crazy times. Well, now um, we are at a special time where basically my city is reopening. Phase one in New York City this Monday. So hopefully I can start going outside a bit more. Yeah. So in terms of the videos, as you see in guys, I did some variety of different things. I started a programming series. You know, that's what I do for a living. I code, so I would wanted to share the joy of programming. I'm starting a little bit slow, you know, just to get your feet wet here and there and talking about the more important thing. And then we're going to take off and do some serious coding like servers, whatever. Also, I seen the new, um, what was it? Uh, Unreal Engine from Epic Games. So maybe we'll do something with this cinematic. Um, love it. Um, you guys met my son. If you watched the reaction to Lane Boy from 21 Pilots, so he was uh, very animated on the video. I think he watched himself like 50 times. Yeah. So 170 days ago, first video went up. And now here we are on June 6th, the hundred videos being made. I wanted to go really with a bang. I create something crazy. See what happens, right? Uh, the editing phase hasn't started yet. Another thing, um, yeah, Final Fantasy 11 finally got my job mastered. Lots of support from that game uh, thank you guys for coming and watching and taking part in this journey yeah, so hopefully as you know the lockdown eases down i go outside start filming a few things bring my son more and more into the videos uh, oh man he he loves he loves to listen to uh, the music he has his cartoons very particular he wants a specific cartoon knows how to pause it, uh, just turned two years old. So yeah, uh, it's getting very interesting. Hopefully my wife too will make an appearance. Uh, her channel's getting made so all in due time. Meanwhile, I'm just chilling, you know, try to keep it positive. Uh, I'm usually in good mood after the window broke. So check this out, right? I want to share this little story of uh, what I'm dealing with, right? So, you know, in New York City, you have this cleaning rules, right? So you have to move the car twice a week because they're cleaning the street, right? So they ease down these rules um, because of the pandemic. But, uh, you know, like two weeks ago, they said, well, we need to refresh some pavements, right? So I go with like very late around like midnight or something. I get to my car, I try to open it, uh, nothing, right? Obviously, the car hasn't been moved like in two months, so the battery died. Okay. So I got into the car, you know, and I have a startup charger in the trunk. But, you know, car is electric, so I can't pop the trunk. All right, I get back into the back seat. I have my child's feet so I can't really push the seat down but there's like a compartment that opens in the middle so I get this thing uh, you know pull it down and now I can get into the trunk and try to get the charger out guess what not gonna fit all right so how do I get into a trunk I don't really want to move the car seat for my son so I figured out that I can pop the top shell it's a GTI, by the way. So I get this thing done and uh, finally got the battery out. I popped the hood. I could not see where was the 
uh, you know the the knobs to put on the the boosters finally i got this thing boosted up i turn it on alarm goes on i try to start the car guess what the booster is dead so the booster is dead the car is dead i can't move the car so i carry this thing almost like a mile and change and it weights about like i would say 25 30 pounds my hands were hurting so uh, get it charged a bit i go back to the car it starts up i drive around you know trying to get the radiator and uh, warmed up you know to recharge the battery move the car to the other side obviously the charger is now in the trunk i'm all happy everything is good and guess what after the car uh, stops i can start it again meanwhile the booster fell down and i scraped my uh my leg so yeah it's been a journey but listen it's positive experience you know you grow from pain and that's it yeah so more stuff is coming definitely exciting time <clears throat> yeah so thank you for sticking with me with your patience oh by the way I face an unbelievable crisis. So I, as you can see from time to time, I upload those long Halo videos, right? The problem with them is that they're heavily graphic intensive and they can take over an hour. So one of the last videos I was making and I started to pay attention of what's going on with my computer. And believe me, I was hitting temperatures like 100 Celsius, CPU 100%. And I was like, man, I'm going to fry this computer if I keep this up. So I was in a big distress because I really wanted to do long videos. And I just couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Could not continue status quo because it was, you know, I don't feel like, uh, you know, replacing a computer. So what you going to do, right? But then like two weeks later, NVIDIA and Adobe, they got their um, stuff in order and it's starting to use hardware encoding instead of software and the CPU is about 50% now and goes up to like 60, 70 Celsius. So I'm all good. Yeah, things are going through. And there will be an interesting video coming up. Uh, like uh, like about a year ago, I was able to stop a con artist. So I want to do a video about this, hopefully help somebody. And I'll give you guys a chance to see if you can solve the mystery. You know, how to stop the con man. All right. All the best. <clears throat> Thank you. <clears throat> no way. Yes, we're ending the video right now. Thank you so much for your support, for your love, your likes, your sharing, everything, guys. You are wonderful. You know, keep up with me. We're going to roll through the journey. World is not easy. All this stuff going down, but we're trying to keep it positive here. All right. Peace out. See you guys again. All the best. Bye-bye. Please subscribe. Bye. <laughs>